In the news tonight, Father Four reminded the prison on guns and ammunition charges. Jack Deal said meeting went extremely well with U.S. Deputy Assistant Secretary for Caribbean Affairs and Haiti's Bureau of Western Hemisphere. And I said to the Deputy Assistant Secretary that the People's Progressive Party is committed to working with all of Guyana, all political parties, and the international community in strengthening our democracy. West Coast Babies Rice Farmers plead for help. Now, if I should break it down, I have to sell three bags of paddy to buy one bag of fertilizer. Terence Williams, a father of four who is attached to the Ministry of Health's storage bond, was today remanded to prison on five charges. These include two guns and ammunition charges and a bribery charge. Williams was arrested following a police probe of a simple larceny report committed on the Ministry of Health's Diamond Bond, where the young man worked as an attendant. According to a police report, during a search of Williams' motor car, they found on the back seat one duffel bag, which, when open, contained a 9mm pistol without magazine and two rounds of 9mm ammunition. The police also found one point three eight zero pistol with a magazine containing seven matching rounds of ammunition and a large quantity of cash. In the side pocket of the said bag, 20 rounds of .380 ammunition were found. Further, the police said while in custody at the Golden Grove Police Station, the accused offered police investigator Leon George a bribe of over $1.7 million to forego the charges. When the matter was called today in the Diamond Magistrates Court, Williams, who hails from farm on the East Bank of Damar, pleaded not guilty to all of the charges and was remanded to prison until April 28. His lawyers Dexter Todd and Dexter Smart made an application for bail owing to the fact that there was multiple occupancy. However, the prosecutor objected to bail. Planning an elegant or corporate event? Let the experts at Star Rentals equip you. Give your event that spectacular five-star experience it deserves with the options of transparent tents of various sizes, indoor and outdoor formal bars and cocktail tables with LED lights, stage, podium with lighting, portable AC units, generators, executive portable washrooms, outdoor light tower, and much more. Call today, 226-3020, online, www.starrentalsgy.com. Star Rentals, we got you covered. Hey, looking for office furniture, stationery, electronics, janitorial supplies, or even dietary products? Okay, stop searching, because we at Imperial Trading have all that and more. Check us out at 73 Section 8 Urban Street, or give us a ring on 639-3785. And be sure to ask about our special discounts. Mm -hmm. Whatever you need, we got it. Because at Imperial Trading, we operate so you can operate. The Ministry of Education is making a significant investment in the education system to distribute textbooks to every primary school pupil to support them at school and at home. So students and parents, please take good care of the textbooks loaned to you and remember to return them at the end of the school year so that the next batch of students can use them. Before collecting the textbooks, parents will sign a contract promising to ensure the books are kept in good condition and to return them. Parents will be required to pay the cost to 
replace or repair any of the lost or damaged books. So let's do the right thing and use the books wisely so that as many students can benefit across Guyana. A message from the Ministry of Education. Vice President Barry Jagdeo has been speaking out about his meeting with the Deputy Assistant Secretary for the Caribbean Affairs and Haiti's Bureau of Western Hemisphere, Barbara Feinstein. Feinstein and her team paid a courtesy call on the leader of the PNCR, Aubrey Norton, on Thursday. This was held at the party's Congress Place headquarters. Jagdeo said the meeting went extremely well today. So in the meeting, we discussed, first of all, democracy in Guyana. And I said to the Deputy Assistant Secretary that the People's Progressive Party is committed to working with all of Guyana, all political parties, and the international community in strengthening our democracy. That this is not an alien value democracy to the, to the PPP, that we have consistently, from the beginning of the party, fought for and defended democracy. On, the, on another matter that um, Mr. Norton released in his report, he complained, complained to the U.S. Um, Deputy Assistant Secretary about the Natural Resources Fund. So I pointed out something that I had done already to the people of this country through a press conference when I explained our amendments to the Natural Resources Fund. Jagdeo was speaking at a press conference at the office of the President. Washi. Hi people. Washing made so easy since I found Washi. Washi me use wash me clothes and I can say. Wash is so powder, wash clothes so nice. Wash is so powder, leave your clothes color bright. Wash is so powder, leave me clothes smelling nice, of course. So give thanks for wash is so powder for doing my laundry in right. Keep my clothes color bright. Have my clothes smelling nice for sure. I could not ask for more. Comes in lemon and original. It is a washing machine in a pack. Wash is so powder, wash clothes are nice. Wash is so powder, leave your clothes color bright. Wash is so powder, have my clothes smelling nice, of course. Distributors located in the Starbrook market. The Ministry of Education is making a significant investment in the education system to distribute textbooks to every primary school pupil to support them at school and at home. So students and parents, please take good care of the textbooks loaned to you and remember to return them at the end of the school year so that the next batch of students can use them. Before collecting the textbooks, parents will sign a contract promising to ensure the books are kept in good condition and to return them. Parents will be required to pay the cost to place or repair any of the lost or damaged books. So let's do the right thing and use the books wisely so that as many students can benefit across Guyana. A message from the Ministry of Education. Some West Coast Barbies rice farmers are calling for help to save their crop, urgent repair to this main access road and improve drainage of the canal. The farmers said coupled with the increase in price for fertilizer, labor and production costs, they stand to lose millions of dollars. This particular crop has been a very hard crop on us after coming from the floods, recovering with some assistance from government, and then back into another situation whereas we knew that prices for uh, fertilizers and, and, and stuff were going up, but we didn't expect that we would have been hit so hard. Now, from what I am seeing on the ground, the price that we are getting or will be getting for body cannot compensate. 
now if I should break it down I have to sell three bags of paddy to buy one bag of fertilizer. I know for me it is very difficult because um, because of the adverse condition over the past four crops I can see it take toll on the land it was difficult to get them properly prepared it was difficult to even harvest it I can show you a portion where one guy had 10 acres bearing rice and the combine couldn't have gone in there so imagine everything was done fertilizing preparation was done and couldn't harvest none yeah most likely that we're going to get a serious serious damage on the crop because we cannot bring out the party how are you going to bring it out if this rain continues so number one we're going to get a loose at the rice field because the place can't dry the, the, the field can, cannot dry Two, to bring the party out, the road condition is very, very bad. You get some new, new vehicles and you will break, break, don't break up at the road up here. Can't work. You have to do something on the road. It's very, very serious. Some of the farmers said party bugs, timely intervention of water when necessary, are among some of the other challenges. Well, if you get no access to bring out the party, we will we go lose it. It's so be the case. You understand? Because we get no access down for bring out the party. There is rain coming. No dam. The crossing we we we, we carry on, on them for, for some 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 farmer assistance. Nobody pay no yield to us. How much acres of rice you found? Oh, we found 160 acres of rice. All all almost the from harvest harvest stage. Some of the farmers we spoke with are from communities such as Washington, Greenfield, Golden Fleece, and King Lee. For these and other stories, do visit us at our website www.rdproductiongy.com.